hi everybody welcome back to my channel thanks for stopping by um i went to a goodwill on what day did i go saturday and this is a little haul i kept swearing to myself that i wasn't going to buy anymore but i just can't resist and i know a lot of us are like that so let's see what we got here um the first thing i got the 3.99 let's open this up were all these little salt cellars and these are heavy so I know they're crystal um, I can't tell there's a name on there uh, I don't know if the camera's gonna pick that up it's hard to see but there is a stamp on there I'll have to get my magnifying glass out looks like a maybe Hawks h-a-w-k-e-s not really sure. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six of those. So I thought they were a pretty good deal. Um, next is this little planter. And there's a lot of crazing on it. It was $2.99. Just says made in Japan. And there's the inside. There were no chips or cracks that I could find. I'll do some research and try to figure out um, comps on this one. And this guy, I thought he was cute. I have no idea what kind of dog that is. So if you know, please tell me in the comments below. Um, says Brazil. Whoops, let me get it in camera range here. For $2.99, there are no chips or cracks. This nose threw me for a minute, but it's not chipped. So if you know what kind of dog this is, please tell me in the comments below. Let's move these out of the way. Then look at this. I was I looked everywhere for the cream. I'm uh, not the creamer. This is the creamer I'm holding in my hand. But I looked everywhere for the sugar bowl and couldn't find it. This to me looks like lusterware. It says made in Japan. Beautiful, beautiful piece. Um, there's a little teeny bump here, but it's not a chip. It's just a little rough spot on that. I didn't open the teapot lid, so let's see. Of course, I don't have scissors here. What I need? Oh, yes, I do. Never mind. Baby scissors. Let's check this lid out. Okay, there are no chips there. And no chips there, just some discoloration. And of course it says made, whoops, made in Japan. So I thought that was really pretty. I'm a teapot collector, so depending on what the comps are, I don't know if I'm going to be keeping this one or selling it. That was cute. And then look at this. Look at this. It's filthy. But look, it's a napkin holder. So you put your napkins underneath it and put this down. But it's mushrooms. How cute. How stinking cute. And it looks like it's hand painted on there. I can't really tell. Um, $2.99. I can't get that off right now. Ugh. Maybe I can. Yeah, there's nothing underneath of it. So we'll just leave that there for now so I can break, log this in. But how cute is that? Once I clean it up, that'll be going up on eBay. So, so cute. And then last but not least is this little general store by Hallmark. It says Mrs. Parkley's General Store. Um... 1994 is $2.99. Looks like it was never even used. It's still in the plastic sleeve, all taped up. But I guess for a little Christmas village, um, I don't want to open it up because it's well, I can't open it up. Look, glee. Yeah, 
here it is. So there's the side. Side says dry goods, stoves, sleigh bells, wagons, and trees. And there's the front of the store. Really, really cute. The other side. And then here's the back. I'm not going to read it out loud to you. I know you guys can read. So I thought that was really cute. So that'll be going up probably on eBay because um, I collect the buyers carolers and this thing is just too small to add with any of that stuff. So that's it. <clears throat> Comment below if you know anything about anything that I have here and uh, that's it. I'm going to get listing and cleaning up and doing my research. See you later and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.